Should you pick a heat pump over your boiler? Will it save you any money in the long term? That's what we're here to find out. Heat pumps are gaining popularity across the UK, but are they the right choice for your home? Today, we're chatting with Phil from G&E Services, a seasoned heat pump installer and proud member of Trade. We also have one of their clients that will speak us through their experience. We'll tackle burning questions like how much they cost or if they're a good choice for you. But first, let's find out how they work. So Phil, how does a heat pump work? So the heat pump has a large fan on it, pulls the air through from the back of the unit and blows it forward. That takes the heat out of the air then goes for a heat exchanger, which transfers the heat into the pipes you can see here. Um, so then those pipes will either go to the radiators or the hot water. Are there properties that aren't suitable for the installation? Uh, we haven't come across any properties that aren't suitable for heat pump installations. So um, we do have to carry out heat loss to confirm this, but yeah, no, normally fine. Do heat pumps need pipe work replaced? It does depend on the property. Um, majority of the time we don't have to replace any pipe work, but we would have to check the size of the pipe work and how old it is. Are heat pumps suitable for both new builds and older homes? Yep, yeah, heat pumps are great for retrofitting like this one to radiators or, or new builds with underfloor heating or, or even radiators, yeah. Is planning permission needed to install a heat pump in the UK? So now, uh, recently, the planning has just changed and uh, you won't need planning to install an air source heat pump. So it sounds like installing a heat pump can be a pretty straightforward process, but now that we understand how heat pumps work, let's meet someone who's already made the switch. This is Jennifer, a homeowner who recently had a heat pump installed in their property. If I were thinking about getting a heat pump myself, what would you say to me? Oh, I would say absolutely get one. Yeah, I, I don't regret that I did at all. Like, you know, when you're looking at it, there's so many worries, like is the house gonna be suitable? Do, are all the radiators gonna be replaced? You know, there are a lot of myths out there, but if you find the right installer, they can answer all your questions, then there's honestly, there's nothing to worry about and it's a really good option. What made you choose to install a heat pump? Well, my boiler was getting very old, so something had to be done. And I wanted to, you know, I'm quite e eco-conscious, so I did want, something to, if I'm going to replace this thing, to do something better for the environment. How long did the installation take? Uh, just a week, actually, it was really quick. What was the most challenging part of the installation? Now, that's a funny question, because the weather was really against us. It had been fine, and then it suddenly plummeted the temperature, and it was raining almost the whole week. So it was really difficult to do the outside work as intended, you know, to the schedule, had to build a concrete base, and that was really difficult. And then on the inside, the cylinder was really big to get in this tiny cupboard. So we actually didn't have hot water the first night as intended. Um, and it was also cold because there was no heating, but we did manage to work around that. Great, so how much did it cost? Just under five and a half thousand pounds. How much did you expect to save on energy bills? Loads. The heat pump actually runs slightly more efficiently than the boiler because of the way it's designed. And on top of that, I then got uh, G&E to install solar panels as well. So that's gonna skyrocket it. Did you use one of the government grants? Yes, I did. Um, and I was really fortunate actually, because by the time I actually got around to getting the heat pump, it had gone up to the latest seven and a half thousand pounds. What are the maintenance costs? very little it's the same as an annual boiler service really just once a year you've been living with it how do you feel i'm so happy this is like one of the best things i think i've ever done like i feel really good that i did something for the environment the house is much warmer the water pressure is better all in all we're it's really good for all of us and we're very happy i'm glad you are in 2024 almost 60,000 people installed a heat pump in the uk we need to understand how the installation works, how to find certified help when doing so, and if it works for your property. Phil, what's the first mistake to avoid when installing a heat pump? Uh, probably choosing a company who aren't MCS registered. So what makes an MCS certified installer different? Uh, MCS uh, come out and inspect us every year. They'll look at our standard of work, make sure we're, we're doing everything to their standards. What do people need to know about the installation? Uh, so installations can take about a week to complete. We have to ha have your heating off um, and we can have a little bit disruption with the electric supply as well. Will I be without heating and hot water? 
Uh, well, our guys do carry around heaters, portable heaters, so we keep our customers warm throughout that week with that. With the, on the hot water side of it, we try and get the old cylinder out, get the new one filled back up on the first day with the immersion going, so you're not without hot water for too long. How much does an installation cost? So it does uh, vary massively on the, on the property and the pipe work and radiators if, if needed. Um, there is a £7,500 grant at the moment from the government to help towards it. But roughly speaking, you're probably looking between 8000 to maybe 15000 minus the government grant. Thanks, Phil. I'm sure there are many more intricacies with installing a heat pump, but why don't we leave those to the professionals? We now know how much it costs, what you need to know before installing one, and how to find the right tradesperson for the job. You can find certified installers like Genie Services on checkatrade.com or by downloading our app. Subscribe for more content like this and let us know in the comments if a heat pump is something you'd consider.